you ready? Hello everyone, I'm Giulia, I'm from Italy, I'm living in Japan since a couple of years. I'm working for Cirque du Soleil, I'm an, an acrobatic dancer. And uh, my idea of art always it was always more than a normal show with audience, with people clapping their hands. It was more spread my voice, spread the feeling that I have uh, for the world, uh, for all those many problems that the world is facing right now. And I always thought, also when I was little, okay, I will try to make this world better using my art. God gave me this kind of art, using the body as a dancer. And uh, as soon as I received the email uh, from uh, Dance for Kids for this project to create this video clip to help uh, African kids, I didn't have any doubts. I immediately wanted to be part of the project. At the beginning, it was more as a choreographer. I thought, okay, I, I will give my idea. But then it was like too, uh, it was so nice uh, after I talked to Chrissy, her energy, her passion uh, for what she's doing, that I said, okay, I will do whatever I can, anytime, anywhere. And uh, I'm glad that in my company I, had, uh, I have good friends and good artists that they wanted to be part of this project too, after I asked them. So the expression of our body is for me like the expression of, of those kids in Africa. Try to give them um, a reason to believe that the world can, can be better, that their life can be better. That, yeah, believe in something and give them uh, some possibilities to grow up in a better way, even if they are facing a really terrible situation. But we are here also for that, trying to help people. Of course our way, as I said already, it's, it's not like psychological way, uh, we are not doctor, but we can say that we are kind of doctor like about uh, love. We, we can give love with our movement, with our choreography, with our kind of expression. And uh, the day of the shooting was one of the best days since I'm here in Japan because it was something that we decided to do. I mean, no one was there forcing, saying, okay, you have to do that, uh, uh, you have to smile, uh, there's audience here. No, no, it was something that was coming out from our heart. And the community, we were 15, 15 artists, it was unbelievable. All smiling, all wanted to be there in that moment for this project. And uh, I can't wait, of course, to see the result of the video. Mm. But beside of the technique, uh, that it's like the less important. It's more, I really hope that with our face and our emotion, we, uh, we could be able to to spray the voice, to give something to them, to the African kids, but to the world in general. Mm. And I think uh, uh, in this, in the last decades of like years of um, cold life, uh, where young people are more interesting on being fashion or on being on TV or anyway famous, I really hope this video can give them uh, to all the all the new generation another point of view the point of view of working working on yourself working to create something and not just being the sheep and following the mm, group of people that say that it's cool uh, to be fashion uh, like i think arts recently is going a little bit on the shadow and uh, theater, thea theatrically, especially. So I also hope that those kids, they will learn from us uh, how to create something new with, with themselves, without the video games or uh, DVDs, a cartoon, whatever. No, we have everything in our hands. We can be dancer, we can be uh, writer, we can, be, we can write a poem, we can sing, uh, we can use our hands to build, to, to paint, uh, really. Like in the past, years, 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 years ago, 
mm, men and women, they create the world where we are living now. Now people, they are destroying the world where we are living now. So like my idea, it's really to give uh, something more, to give uh, more hopes that the world can be better and also facing sickness uh, and troubles. You can face sickness and troubles with a smile and try to fight for your rights and for the rights of who is beside you. Mm -hmm. Wow, thank you, that's brilliant.